competition. And the way I think about it is I think it's a mixture of culture, uh, how long they've been around, and how much they're beholding to investors to ensure that beautiful dividend doesn't go away. Because the second you start making massive capex into EVs and a technology that you haven't been able to be profitable at, all of a sudden, that beautiful stock thing that a lot of these executives are getting paid with starts to tank because you have to cut back dividends to be able to fund this on, with, unless you raise a bunch of debt, which is going to make your already ballooning debt go even higher. So you yeah. have these like multiple variables. And I, I don't think this is exclusive to GM. I don't want to pick on them. I think this is, this is a legacy auto problem. Legacy, legacy right? auto. Yeah. Is that a fair? Tell me if I'm being too harsh. No, it's it's accurate. The they if you if you think about it from one perspective, GM, I don't know what the final number was, but made phenomenal profits last year. So Wall Street happy, investors happy, top leadership happy with those bonuses. Uh, along those metrics, wow, what are we doing wrong? We're great profits. Well, our, come on, guys, you're you're paid a lot of money to th think beyond the narrowness of short-term profitability around trucks. Where's the world going? How do we can get competitive? So I'm afraid that what you describe is exactly what's going on, is it's, it's very financially driven, not imaginative. If you ask me about my time, I had never worked in a big kind. I always started my own companies in Asia. Then I was recruited from the outside to come to GM to, to bring some new thinking, fresh thinking. and. Two things struck me immediately. One, very inward looking around, we're a manufacturing company and we're focused on us. And this year's product is so much better than last year's product that every customer is gonna want it. But without the mindset of, oh, the customer has enough, about 20 other choices. That didn't occur to them. So that was one big shock for me coming into, no, it was inward looking. We're doing better than we did last year. It doesn't mean anything to the customer. 